Hello children, how are you all? I hope you all are fine and safe at your home. Now students, after completing the Indian number of system and discussing many questions related to that, today we are going to start a new topic from the same chapter and that is international number system. So as you all know that there are two kinds of number systems, Indian number system which we have already discussed and then I have the second one which is international number system. In international number system as you can see on the screen there are periods of three three digits that means there are groups of three three digits together. The first group which is a ones group which contains ones, tens, hundred. The second group which is of thousands it has thousand, ten thousand and hundred thousand. The third group is of millions, after thousand now it is millions and the third group contains millions having 1 million, 10 million and 100 million. Right students? So as you can see here and we have already discussed these, this thing in our live class also. So I hope this international number system is also clear to all of you. Okay, so today we are going to discuss the questions which are mostly related to international number of system, how to write the number names for an international number of system for any number and also how to write the numeral when the number name is given to us in international system. Okay students, so starting up with the questions taken from your book exercise. First question says write the number names using the international system. So using this international system which we have discussed let us start writing the number name. As you can see here there are groups of three three digits together and this first group is of ones. If I write its place value ones, tens, hundred then thousand. 10,000, 100,000, then million and 10 million. Now after placing its place values and you know the groups also, the first group is of ones, second group of thousands which is also known as periods and the third group is of millions. So now can we write its name, number name? Yes, let us write its number name 27 millions. So it is 27 million 500,000. 500. You can read the number 500 and it is in the thousand group. So 5. 100,000 Then moving to the next group 231 So it is 231 so this is our number name for the first numeral according to international number of system 27,500,231 Right students? Moving to the second one Once again if you see this is our ones group, thousand group and the million group Can we just write the name without even writing the place values? Yes, let's see Three million. So the first group is of 3 million. 004 means 4. Only 4 and in which group it is? 1000 group. So 3 million 4000. In the next group 605. So then 6 Hundred five. So this is the number name for both the numerals according to the international system. I hope it is clear to all of you. Moving to the second question, write the numerals 
for the given number name. Now the number names are given to you and you have to write its numeral. So opposite to that, while writing the numeral for the given number name, very first you have to check till which group we have to go. That means in which period we have to write the number. So reading the first one, it is 605 million. So we have to move till million pe uh, period and it is 605 million. So it will be 605 million. So since this one of the group is complete, so you will put a comma here. It will separate one of the group. This is our million group or it is a million period. Then moving forward, 6000. So in the 1000 group, we have only 6. In 1000 group, it is only 6. So that will be 0, 0, 6. And this is our 6000. In the 1000 group, it is only 6. That means it's 110,000 place. That means it is it's 10,000 and 100,000 places filled with 0. So it becomes 6,000. Moving forward to the next period, 101. So it is 101. Clear students? This is how you have to write the number in the numeral form. Once again, 605 million. So this is our 605 million. 6,000, in the 1,000 group only 6 is there, so it is 6, 6,101. So this is your numeral for the given number name. Now the second part, 400 million. Which number is there in the million group? 400. So we will write 400 and this is our first group of millions. Second, 400 Thousand. In the thousand group, once again we have 400. So it is 400 million, 400 thousand. Last one, 400. Now the ones group, once again it is 400. So this is your number, 400 million, 400 thousand, 400. So this is your numeral for the second given number name. I hope both the ways and both the concepts are clear to all of you. Moving forward with the third question in which you have to write the given numbers in its ascending order. What is ascending order? Ascending order starting from the smaller to the biggest. So we have to start writing with the smallest value and reach till the greatest one. So here when the numbers are given to you, as you can see there are four given numbers, four numbers given to us. So these are the four numbers and all the numbers are given to us according to the Indian number of system. So very first reading the number here, 1 crore 55 lakh 85,732, 1 crore 55 lakh 58,732, 1 crore 55 lakh 58,237 and 1 crore 58 lakh 55,72. When you have to write the numbers in the ascending order, we have to compare the digits from extreme left. That means the first digit. First digit from the left side. So which digit is there? 1. 1 at crore place. 1 at crore place. 1. 1. That means in all the four values if we compare its crore place it is same 1 crore 1 crore 1 crore it is all same now since all the four values are equal so we will move to the next digit now the next digit at 10 lakh place is 5 5 5 5 this is also same then what we will do we will move to the next place value so comparing the result at 1 lakh place, 5, 5, 5, 8, 8, it is bigger, this is bigger, so you have, you don't have to count this, now just keep it on one side because 8 is greater, we want smallest value, we want smallest value, so we will not count this value, now you have to compare between these 3, 
Now comparing the next digit. 8, 5, 5. Now 8 is bigger. 8 is bigger. So we will discard this number also. Now compare between these two. Now 5 and 5, these two are equal. 8 and 8 is also equal. Comparing the digit at 100 place. We have 7 here and 2 here. Which value is smaller? 2 is smaller. That means this is the smallest number among the 4 given values. So starting of its solution, which is the smallest value here? 1 crore 55 lakh 58,237. So we are done with this number. This is our first number, the smallest number. Now, since this is the biggest number, so next greater value will be between these two. So now if I compare between these two and if you compare its 10,000 place, we have 8 here and 5 here. So which will be the second number? This. This will be our second greater number. So writing the second number, 1 crore 55 lakh 58,732. Now moving forward with the next greater value. Which will be the next greater value? This. Because that one is the biggest value. It is already 1 crore 58 lakh. Here it is 1 crore 55 lakh only. So the next number will be 1 crore 55 lakh 85,732. And writing the biggest value among the four, 1 crore 58 lakh 55,732. So hence, we have arranged the number in its ascending order. Now, when you are doing the ascending order, you can, instead of putting these commas, you may also put the sign of greater than. So that you can, anybody can easily identify that these numbers are arranged in its ascending order. So you have to put these greater than sign after every number. Clear? Similarly, as we have understood the concept of ascending order, in the same manner, you can also arrange the numbers in its descending order. Descending order means you have to start with the biggest number. So, biggest to the smallest. I hope you will do it yourself in your book. Coming to the fourth question, in which you have to write the periods and place value of the underlying digit. So, here you have to write the place value and period for these two underlying digits, digit 5 and digit 4. So writing its solution, very first if I talk about place value, so place value will be 1s, 10s, 100, 1000, 10,000, lakh, 10 lakh, crore, 10 crore. So if I talk about place value of 4. What is the place value of 4? 4 is at 1000 place. So you can write it as 4 thousands or you can also write it as 4 thousand in figure. That means in the numeral form. So this is the place value of 4. Now coming to the second part when you have to write the period of digit 4. In which period? That means in which group it is coming. It is coming in the group of 1000. This is our 1000 group. This is our 1's group, 1000 group, lakh group and crore group. So in which group it is? 1000's group. So the period for digit 4 is 1000's period. Okay? Similarly, if you have to write the place value of digit 5, so what is the place value of 5? 10 lakh. So you can write that 5 is at 10 lakhs position. And you can also write the same value in the numeral form. So this becomes 50 lakh. It becomes 50 lakh. Now coming to the last part. Period of desert 5. In which period this 5 is lying? It is lying in the lags period. So it is lags. Okay students. So, so 
today we have discussed the numbers and international number system we have learned how to write the number name we learned how to write the numeral for the given number name ascending and descending order and also the place value and the period for any underline or circle digit in a given number i hope today's lesson is clear to all of you thank you for the lesson students have a great day